farm like you farm on keeping it there, of keeping small producer, your carrot guy having land to grow on, what, why is it important that as a country, as people, we, we support that? Um, the farms through industry and home building are getting pushed to the wayside. And I think it's important that um, we have a lot of small farms so that we're not leaving a huge carbon footprint, that we're not shipping things halfway across the world just to get them to us when they can be grown locally and they can support the community that they're in. You do all this work. It is a lot of work. You're there at 7 in the morning at the farm. It'd be a lot easier just to call up Cisco and get truckloads. Um, it's just morning, noon, and night for you. What's it all for? Um, I don't know. That's, um, it's all for freshness. Um, actually, I'm lying when I say that. It's for my heart and for my soul. I really love what I do. And the farm's an important part of that. It's about bringing it into the kitchen. It's about teaching. It's about sharing. It's about bringing knowledge to other people that they don't have. Um, and it makes me feel good. Do you feel like you're a pioneer of sorts, that you're kind of paving way for other chefs? No, there are a lot of chefs that do this. I just have fun doing it. <laughs> is there anything else you want? No. All right, best chef joke. Best chef joke. You need a joke. Can't get out of here till you get <laughs> Did you hear about the chef they just arrested? <laughs> he got caught beating the eggs and whipping the cream. <laughs> ba boom. It's so clean. <laughs> it's not what I expected from you. All right, we just needed a smile. <laughs> Fantastic. That's good. That's it. Unless there's anything else right. you want to say. All right. No, I think that's it. No. All right. We're good. Good. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs>